Oops. Hey, YouTube. Um, this is my second video today. As I told you guys, I didn't know when I was going to retwist or not. By the time I left work, I was like, I'm retwisting. So, my hair is still wet. I got to go sit up under the dryer. I just wanted to do this quick video to show you I retwisted. Um, what I shampooed with, I don't have it in front of me, was again, you've seen it in past videos, my Apogee Deep Moisture. Um, shampoo, before I did that, I did an apple cider vinegar rinse. Um, and it tingled. I've never done one of my hair before. I've always done my daughter's, but my scalp was tingling. And yes, I did, um, diluted with water, but it was tingling. So I let it sit for like five minutes. Then I shampooed my hair twice. And then, because my hair is not locked yet, what I did was, I used the Apogee Protein Leave-In Conditioner, which is a liquid. I put it in here. I did dilute. I used one part water. So probably I did about maybe this much water where my finger is. And then two parts, which is like up here, of the um, leave-in. And then sprayed my whole head. And then I used in combination, I don't have it here, the Eco Style of Blue Gel and a Talia YG. And, YG it. and then in between, this is my castor oil olive oil, coconut oil. I also have in that bottle the Hydrothermal Natural Growth Oil. I have some rose, like 10 drops of rosemary and 10 drops of peppermint oil here. And I, this is what me and my daughter actually um, oil our scalp with every other day. This is what I put on my, um, my scalp. It tingles, it smells like rosemary and peppermint. So, But I know the rosemary helps aid in hair growth and the peppermint. So, that's what's in my hair. Um, and that's pretty much it. So, you can see, like I said before, I took two, I think I took two or three coils and made an extra one. So, I have either 113 or 114 opposed to the 111 that I had. You know, so I'm going to go sit up under the dryer and re-dry my hair. Well, not redry, but dry my hair. And I'm going to try to wait to twist it again. Saturday, I'll be a month. It's like a 20-something. 19th is the following Saturday. Or the 24th. So I'm going to try to see if I can hold out to the 24th. That'll be two weeks, but who knows. Um... Other than that, I will talk to you guys later.